hey guys welcome to my youtube channel today i am going to show you how to create hyperlink and button link on a visual basic form and open a web page in a browser window also change the mouse pointer on hover in this application we have created a hyperlink using label control and button link using command button as we hover the cursor over the link the cursor is changed to hand pointer and when I click on this link, it will open a web page in a browser. In my case, google.com page will open in Internet Explorer. Now we will make this application from scratch. So let's get started. Open Visual Basic and start with a new project. Click on Standard EXE and click on Open button. And first we will go to the project menu and here we will click on References. And here we will select Microsoft Internet Control. Just click on it and click on OK. Now we will add one label control, one command button on the form and set the following properties. For label control, the name property will be link label. Caption is click here and tooltip property to open a web page in browser. In same way, click on command button and set the following properties. Tooltip property to open a web page in browser. Name property link btn. Link btn. Caption is click here. Click here. Now apply font to both the controls. Now open the code window, just right click on the form and go to view code and open the form load event and here you have to write the following code. Now run the application. Here you can see the label control is now just look like a hyperlink and tool tip text is also shown alongside the controls so now we will add the code to open a web page in a browser using these links now double click on the label control and write the following code now double click on the command button and just copy the code from label control and paste in the command button now after writing the code for hyperlink and link button now run the application as you click on the label control hyperlink a web page will open in the browser in same way when you click on this command button as well a new web page is open in the browser. Now we will change the cursor to a different mouse pointer. For this just click on the label control and go to the mouse pointer property. Here zero default is the by default setting and you will find a list of mouse pointer available. So I am just selecting the 14th arrow and question mark and now I am running the application again. As we hover over the link the cursor is changed to arrow and question mark. This is how you can change the cursor to a different mouse pointer. As you see in the mouse pointer property there are total 15 types of mouse pointer available but no hand pointer available here. So you have to go to the custom 99 and now go to the mouse icon and here you have browse the hand pointer from the installation folder. So you have to click on upper button and go to the common folder here you will find a graphics folder double click on it and here are the folder called cursors here you will find so many cursors available so i am simply selecting hand point this is the cursor and click on open now again run the application 
as we hover over the link you can see the hand pointer in place of cursor so this is how you can apply different types of mouse pointer over the links same way we will apply the different mouse pointer to command button just click on command button and go to mouse pointer and see here we will select 99 custom and then go to mouse icon and browse the location of cursors and here we will select and and click on open and now again run the application here as we hover over the command button link the cursor is changed to hand pointer and when we click on this link a web page is open in internet explorer so this is how you can create hyperlink and link button to open a web page and also change the cursor to a different mouse pointer so that's it for today i hope you like this video please like and share thanks and have a nice day